Good morning, HF, and welcome to the VTV Daily Show. I'm Cora McMillan. And I'm Jalen White. What a week, huh? It certainly has started off very interesting, to say the least. We hope you were able to watch the message this morning from Dr. Anderson and Dr. Mansfield. It sounded like the administration is being very supportive in this difficult time. Yeah, and that will continue tomorrow. Like they say, during your English classes tomorrow, you will be able to watch a live feed of VTV where administration and a student panel will be on hand to answer questions and have a discussion about the events from this weekend. More information will be coming out to teachers in an email, but know that you'll be able to text in questions about anything that may be on your mind and they will, they will provide answers. Again, teachers can look for more information about tomorrow plus the link to be able to watch us live all day long tomorrow. In the meantime, let's get started with the news. The fourth quarter senior public debate will be tomorrow at 7 p.m. in the North Cafeteria. See Tiana Sharp and George Waddell go up against Deja Austin and Lavelle Van on the topic, New York is a better vacation destination than Chicago. Tickets are $3 at the door and there will be a bake sale as well. Get your copy of Edda's 2019 Identity Politics, only $5 at the campus bookstore. This year's issue features the arts and writing of talented HF students. If you pre-order your copy at registration, please show your ID at the campus bookstore. Recycle Palooza is an event taking place this Saturday, May 4th, to allow the community to drop off things they can't normally recycle with the disposal service every week. It's on May 4th from 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. in the Parker Junior High parking lot. Chinese Club meets for the last time at 3.15 on Thursday, and we're going to Chinatown to enjoy the Chinese food and make sure you bring enough money to cover your expenses. We'll be back around 7.30 p.m. and make sure that you have pickup arranged. IB program students are running a supply drive for the South Suburban Humane Society. Please donate any food, toys, or other supplies listed on the flyers throughout the school. Donations can be dropped off throughout this week in both cafeterias, Ms. Pinno, or Mr. Sigler's classrooms. Key Club has its very favorite event coming up on Monday, April 29th from 5.30 to 8.30 p.m. called An Evening Together for the Cancer Support Center. Volunteers will help in various capacities such as event setup, serving, and cleanup. Signups are in Mrs. Kluth room in E2. Senior t-shirts are available until Friday, May 3rd at the campus store. Shirts are $10. We're looking for unified partners for the 2019-2020 school year. If you're interested in being a part of the program that promotes acceptance and respect through sports, please come to our meeting on Wednesday, May 15, 2019 in room 230 North. We are also looking for members who will be interested in joining a social club, the Just Like You Club. If any of this interests you, please come to our informational meeting on May 15th in room 230 at 315 p.m. We'd like to thank everyone that voted last week for the student government elections. It was decided in the class of 2021 that the president will be Eden Mitchell and the activity chair will be Emma Minsaw. Congratulations to you both. As you all may know, on Wednesday, May 1st, is typically when you all make your decision on your intended plans for next year. On Friday, May 10th, the guidance office would like to help support your decision. We are recognizing this day as Decision Day 2019. Whether you're attending a two-year or four-year college, the military, going into the workforce, or taking a gap year, we'd like to recognize you. So please have fun and celebrate on May 1st by repping your decision. On Friday, May 10th, we would like to celebrate with you again, so show your pride by wearing your decision on this day as well. Let's make this a big celebration day. Again, whether you are attending a two-year or four-year college, the military, going into the workforce, or taking a gap year, wear your decision proud that day. Please note that if you are planning to attend a four-year college, we do need a copy of your acceptance letter. There will be an enlarged map in front of South Lunchroom for you to place stickers on the map of where you are planning to attend. We will be there during passing periods and lunch periods. Feel free to stop down and take part. Let's take the time to celebrate the next step in your journey. That's all the announcements we have today, so let's send it over to Mae Van Etten, who has the latest in sports. Thank you guys, I'm Maven and here to catch you up on all the happenings in sports. HF Ultimate Frisbee has a scrimmage today after school at the JV soccer field. Come dressed and ready to play. The girls track team placed first at the Borgia Invite in Louisville, Kentucky this weekend. Kayla McCall was first in the 100 hurdles at 13.96, which is the fastest time in the state. Madison Myrick leaped 5'9 in the high jump to set a new school record. The 4x1 and 4x200 relays both got first and have the fastest time in the state and the 4x400 relay also placed first. Great meet, girls. The varsity boys tennis team won two matches the last two days. On Wednesday, the team defeated Andrew 
The team was led by second doubles team of junior Miles Prado and freshman Noah Roberts, who won 6-2, 6-2. On Thursday, the team defeated Bolingbrook 7-0. The team was led by third single senior Elliot Opp, who won 6-4, 6-2. The Varsity Girls Badminton team will be hosting sectionals this year. These matches will take place in, on Thursday in the North Fieldhouse at 4.30. Come out and support your Lady Vikings. Okay, that's all the sports that were reported to us. I'm Maven Enden in the Sports Corner. Short and sweet, that's all we have for you today. Thanks for tuning in and we'll see you back here tomorrow for the live version of VTV all day long. For everyone here at VTV, I'm Jalen White. And I'm Cora McMillan. Have a great day.